capital of Madagascar, an ever-bustling, vibrant metropolis, and Tananarivo, or as it is often called by the people living here, Tana, the city of the thousand. The city, which is situated in the centre of the island, lengthwise, in the northern part of the so-called Central Plateau, was founded in 1625 and was made the centre of the kingdom of the Marina Kings. During the conquest, its importance gradually increased and it became the capital of the country in the 18th century. The French occupied it in 1895 and made it the centre of the colonial administration and the seat of Governor General. After independence, the city rapidly developed. Its population increased apace. This is currently the country's largest city with about 1.8 million inhabitants and also the island's administrative, economic and communication centre. Tana, similar to other Asian and African capitals, is rather noisy and crowded. Nevertheless, it is worth visiting because there are a number of specific attractions such as the Haute-Ville district full of restaurants and nightclubs or the Arab markets and Alekeli and Zoma, famous for their street mongers and in which many local specialities and folk art objects can be found. One of the main attractions of the city is the Anasi Lake, with a World War I memorial in the middle, which you can also admire from above on the hills. It is worth walking along the Avenue of Independence, where casual traders offer their goods for not only the passers-by, but even those who can travel by cars. At all times of the day, there is a huge crowd flowing in the streets, as if no one ever stood still, but that everyone had somewhere to go. From the hills, there is not only a great view of the city, but also of rice fields, where the main ingredient of the local gastronomy is produced. The flooded lands reflect the image of the city and the slowly westbound sun.